Hey guys, how's it going? It's Estes here. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful day. And welcome back to another episode of God of War Ragnarok. Hit the like button and subscribe if you want to get notified or updated on the next video. Alright, let's jump back where we left off from the previous episode. So it's been a while since I last played Ragnarok, so it might be a little rough at the beginning since I've been busy with Wulong. Right, so I believe we were hunting down more dragons. Oh, there's the dragon. The pillar. So this thing here. Now what? Gotta break that pillar too. Another Crap. dragon. Got rid of it for now. We better hunt it down or it'll be back. So I saw this chain here. Let's pull this chain. We burn this. That come closer. We are near the source. I am listening. Five hours due north. Two hours east. I said I would find this valley a new home after the eight seer destroyed mine. So, what happened? I cannot remember. I know that I wanted. Do you remember seeing anything that could help us find the other half of your hourglass? There were three waterfalls. I remember wishing I could live near them. All right, then. Looks like we have another side quest. Odin must have been really mad when Freya left him to do all this. Odin was never going to stop. That's why he sent Thor. Did she challenge Thor? Challenge Odin? Who knows? But the so we burn this. Helka! There must be a way across. We work everywhere. There we are. <laughs> <laughs> Another crystal for the pond. I guess we're going in this tunnel. Aye, watch my head on these walls, brother. Am I not always careful with you? Oh yeah, always the lightest touch. I wonder what we're going to something find on this side. On Probably something really big. No matter the size. Every creature has a weakness. Huh. Quiet all of a sudden. It's charging! Oh crap. It's a bloody drake! Crap. It's 
To get this help. Oh, Alright, let's try this again. Oh, nice. Wow, that was really good. We should have anticipated such a beast in this valley. Well, always expect the unexpected, right? I just hope this means an end to all the shaking. Maybe by the time we're done in this valley, it won't be such a bad place to settle down. And with that, we've now taken down about half the dragons in this crater as well. Huh. I can hear the birds. They're rooting for us. That's nice. Okay, so we can go in here or we can go check out what's over there. Let's go check out what's over there. Whoops. Hold on, let me check if there's anything here.
Ah, another of Cavassier's poems. So before we keep on continuing, let's um let's go back and check what's on the other side. Oh, never mind. It just brings us back here. Hmm. So it's a shortcut. Alright, let's go back down and, um, we'll find the other dragon. That was really close. It's a stupid plant. Oh, son of a bitch. Just came out of nowhere. Yeah, was this asshole here? Got damn plants. Right, I'm gonna go get that chest. There it is. Okay, now we go back up. From the looks of it, the dragon is, I guess, this way.
Maybe on this side. No, never mind. The chain's on this side. Hmm. I guess we can try going on the boat. and getting the sense you've actually gotten to know Thor's daughter somewhat. Yeah, Thrud's great. Wants to be a Valkyrie one day. And she deserves to be. Of course, I told her all about the Valkyries we faced, but I'm not sure how much she believes me. It didn't feel great when I tried to tell her stories about her grandfather, though. Anyone can have a blind spot when it comes to family. Some only learn the truth in the hardest way. So now we can go here. How Thor and Sif raised Magni and Modi, and you said they raised them brutally. Enough. We will continue later. Star blush. <clears throat> okay, so we got the chest. Now let's see if this does anything. Kind of funny. Oh, yeah, I'm not sure if it changed anything. Anyways, let's pull this chain. travel. You see, Yari was raised a Midgardian warrior, meant to fight in the family's wars, find a wife, die for glory. But he rejected it. He left. He so did I get it? Path. I wouldn't be surprised if we found their mark in other realms as well. Okay, let's get this chest. No doubt a berserker awaits. Oh, we got a berserker. Um, I guess we can try it once, see what it's like. Oh, 
Don't even have a chance. Um, let's try one more time. Well, that went better. So yeah, we're gonna leave that one for next time. So back to hunting the dragon. There's a raven. Can't do anything about that one though. Looks like we can land over there on that beach. Oh, there's the dragon. Let's get this loot here. Bet the dragon roosts up there. Another painful growth removed from these lines. Up there. Eh? Back. Oh crap. The way up. What an asshole. I'm trying to get that raven. This asshole dragon's not gonna let me. No, it's too far. Nice. Got it. So it looks like this is the way. Um I wanna check what's over there real quick. Oh just a shortcut. Oh, 
Holy shit. Right, then um, how do we get past this dragon? Why not pay the pool a visit? Oh, God damn it. Question first, brother. You wanted to make this valley your home. What stopped you? I remember this valley. It was on the brink of devastation when I found it. Was it a crater like you see now? No, but the town was in shambles. Shattered glass, broken buildings. There was no home to be made here. Did you see what caused the destruction? Yes. I remember now. On the day the valley was destroyed, Thor was swinging his hammer wildly through town. Everyone was terrified. Then, a fair-haired warrior stepped in his path, and a fight began. She was a brave woman. Nice. This we completed that. Must have been Fay, brother. Yeah, monster at the thought. I'm not sure if Fay had bravery or bravar. Ooh, that's kind of nice. I actually like that. I'll probably use it next time uh, I can put it in. Not many live to tell the tale of a fight with Thor. Fay never spoke of fighting him. 
Everyone has secrets. We do not know for certain this was Faye. Aye. There is only one way to find out, brother. There we go. Yeah, that did it. Okay, so where are we going next? I guess up here. Yeah, it looks like that's where we're going. Dragons here. Oh crap. Father, watch out! You're on fire, Kratos! It will pass! Hit the throw! All right, there it goes. Oh, shit. Was a close one. Need the health. dead Dragon's here Prepare yourself Eyes up Let's 
So dead. Okay, you need to break this pillar. Got it. Well, that wasn't so bad either. Only took me a few attempts. Well, this one's done. Got a ways to go before this creature's cleared out. We killed the dragon. I think we got in all the dragons so far. You can yell at me if you want. We're leaving. What would that accomplish? So yeah, we completed this. No. You didn't trust me enough to talk through your worries. That's a wound not easily mended. I'm sorry. The fault is mine. <sighs>
now let's go home. Let's continue on with the main story. We don't have any more dragons to kill. I think we got all of them. Mimir, we were talking about how Thor and Sif raised Magni and Modi. And you said they raised them brutally. What does that mean? Old. We will finish later. I wanted to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Well, it's somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. I have need of your help. As you ask. They look quite healthy. It looks like we're only missing one. Speak. The tree has become rather overgrown. And? And if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the Four Seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags... Yeah, we've seen those stags around. I greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the nine realms i suppose we have seen these stags great then all you need is some feed once you've found a stag the feed should calm them down then one of my spectrals will guide them back here and uh don't eat the feed please i will not vision has asked me if i was too chicken to release them but i am in fact not chicken like whatsoever so as you can see i have no choice Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank, Fimblewinter prevented the stags from returning, and now they have long since scattered to parts unknown. It was worth it! Now then, any luck finding those lean worms? So were you always a freakishly large immortal squirrel, or...? <laughs> Don't forget handsome. No, I was once a regular squirrel. The same size as these wispy, spectral versions of myself, in fact. I was unremarkable. I stumbled upon the tree near what should have been the end of my life, the victim of a random act of predatory savagery. But the tree, it had other plans for an insignificant creature like me. But I have prattled on for far too long. I will leave you be, Master Kratos. Well, stay safe, everyone. Hey, tell her she's the best. Oh, you're back. The heroes of the hour. I Is he want drunk? To hear everything. I mean, when you're ready, I'm not giving orders here, am I? Try to rest, Ingvi. Let the herbs work. Oh, they work? Oh, they, they work very well. Because you make things better. You always have. Since... Since we were kids, I find a new way to get into trouble. And you find a way to make it better. Well, that's certainly true. Do you know... <clears throat> do you know we used to leave Vanaheim? Together? When we were young? Not much older than you, to be honest. Well, you know, she did the leading. 
I just tried to keep things fun. <laughs> Leadership, not really my strong suit, let's be honest. <laughs> really? Your group back in Vanaheim seems pretty devoted. Well, I can inspire people, I guess. Uh, you get them to see the best in themselves, you know? I don't know if that's leadership. It's more like, um... Like a muse? Wait. Like... like a what? A muse. Father told me about that. In his homeland, they inspired all kinds of artists. What? I love that. That's a job? Well, why don't we have that? Oh, man. I could totally do that. <laughs> I think this guy's so drunk. Well, come on. That's not fair. That's not fair. I I would be a natural. Oh. What were we talking about? Ingvi, you must rest. You understand? You must. Please just stop talking. Okay. I'm sorry. But someone was gonna fill us in on what happened with Heimdall, right? Is that what's happening? Patience. All right, then let's uh let's turn this in. Hey, you think Sin enough? Look at that! <laughs> you really did it. How? In all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody! Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refused that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can't. Use... Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers. Maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Please. You are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you... Then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. You know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I 
I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, you heard me. And therein lies a tale. So yeah, that was quite something. Anyways, uh, we're going to continue this on the next episode. If you guys want to get notified or updated on the next video, hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.